We already did a question like this in this set. Question one was the same thing. We have a, a great plug points into equation situation. We have some points, right? We got a bunch of numbers. What can we plug them into? Well, we can plug them into a uh, our basic formula, our equation for average, right? So the average is the sum of the numbers over the number of numbers. Don't think too hard about this. We have the uh, mean being 6.7 for a total of 20 people. So without thinking too hard, I'm gonna find that sum by multiplying by 20. So times 20 times 20. So 6.7 times 20, normal calculator is 134. That's my sum of the original set. Then what happens? Then uh, this, uh, one of the employees leaves, meaning now we have 19 employees. And the uh, remaining place of work for the company is reduced. That's the mean is reduced to 6.25. So we still don't know the sum. Now I multiply by 19 on both sides. And I get a sum of 6.25 times 19 is 118.75. Right? So we lost a person. And the total number of, I don't even know what this is, uh, the, 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 the amount of time the number of years, the number of years has decreased by some number. Let's find that decrease. Let's do a little subtraction here. So 134 minus 118.75 is 15.25. Done. This is the kind of question that I sometimes talk about as being like some, a middle question that you need to master. It's slightly hard in that they're asking us to deal with average, but they're doing it in a way where it's not like that kind of way our teachers taught us to deal with average. Just Add up the numbers, divide, and then you're done. You, you're solving for the average. That's a basic average question. This one is kind of reversing it. It's giving us the average. It's changing the set in some way. We have to use the formula twice, but it's still the formula. So this is this is the kind of question you need to get right on every SAT, and you need to get right confidently. You cannot stare at this wondering what to do. If you're thinking about it in terms of plug points and equations, you've got to plan right away. We always want to plug points into equations. We have an equation for average, for mean. So you've got to be able to put that on your page right away, start plugging in, and the rest of the thing kind of just solves itself.